13 on your side weather deck is sponsored by Montel Construction, your home team. Welcome back to 13 on your side. I'm meteorologist Samantha Jacks outside on the weather deck enjoying these dry conditions for one final day before we do head into a bit of a stormy pattern as we track into your Thursday. Until then, our weather ball remains solid red as we have warmer temperatures ahead today. The 13 weather ball is sponsored by LaFontaine Lincoln Grand Rapids. Now, in terms of our current conditions this morning, we're sitting at 57 degrees in Grand Rapids, so a little bit cooler outside. 60 degrees in Ludington. Winds right now are nice and calm. They're going to be out of the south and west throughout the day today, actually dragging in a slightly warmer air mass, of course, why the weather ball is red. So by the time we hit around noon today, we actually will be as warm as we topped out yesterday afternoon. After that, we continue to climb to about 84 degrees during the afternoon hours underneath low humidity levels, which so another comfortable day is in sight. As for our um, conditions for tomorrow, that's where they get a little bit stormier. Tonight, we have about a 30% chance for an isolated shower or storm to develop. Temperature wise, hanging on into the mid 60s, so also a little bit warmer than what we've been experiencing the last couple of nights. And then tomorrow, that low end threat for severe weather. Let's delve a little bit deeper into that. So we've got this low pressure system off to the north and west of us and an associated cold front along with it. As that cold front works towards our area, we are placed underneath a level one threat for severe weather. Not all of West Michigan though. So if you're up towards Fremont, Big Rapids, Ludington, Pentwater, you're gonna be left out of the severe wet severe threat for tomorrow. It's the further south and east that you travel that there's actually a lot of the right ingredients present from Cleveland through Fort Wayne and into Detroit. For us here in West Michigan, it's not looking to be as strong of an environment for those storms to become severe, but it is still something that we need to be mindful of heading into tomorrow. As for 8 o'clock this morning, or tomorrow morning, I should say, a couple isolated thunderstorms. That's not the batch that we're going to be watching. It's right around noon and continuing on until around 3 to 4 o'clock that we could potentially see some strong to severe storms. They exit the region and we're left with mostly sunny skies to round out your Thursday and heading into Friday back to quiet skies. So it'll be a short lived event. It's not going to be widespread rain showers for everybody, but those who do see a thunderstorm cell or two develop need to be mindful of its strength. In terms of severe outlook, it could be gusty winds, maybe in some hail and a heavy burst of rain. Temperature wise today along the lakeshore, 82 degrees for Muskegon and Holland. Winds are going to be at around 5 to 10 miles per hour, so not super noticeable throughout the day today. 84 for Grand Rapids. The rest of your 13 on your side, 10 day forecast. We did add just a 30% chance for some pop up showers in the afternoon hours on Sunday. We continue on with some chances for storms on Monday as well. None of those days look to be washouts by any means.